All right, so now we're going to be talking about the holding feature that is now available. So to access that, you're going to go to the index and the hold page. And now it's going to bring up the legs page because it's allowing you to an option to select from a fix that's on your flight plan. Or you could type one in and put it in, in the, uh, the boxes here with the left six line select key here. However, we're just, for this demonstration, we're just going to go ahead and pick Luigi. We're going to click that. It's going to drop in the scratch pad and we'll click it here. It's going to bring up this page here. Um, you see it's already kind of drawn out a, a hold here. However, we're just going to draw, we're going to input our own. Um, so going from the top, it's going to tell us what our entry is for the procedure, and it will fly that entry. Um, right now, the speeds don't really do anything, but in the future, we're going to have an option, or you'll have messages that come up once you, um, you know, if you're too fast, it'll tell you to slow down, things like that. The quadrant and radial feature right now does not work. So we're going to use the inbound course and the direction to input our hold. So let's see. Um, let's try it today. We're going to hold on the 150 inbound course with right turns. Go ahead and drop that there. It's going to recalculate. And you'll see now we have a parallel entry. So it's going to fly to the fix, fly parallel to the course, come back around, and then start the hold. And it shows our leg time here of one minute. It's already calculating calculating that. You could put 1.5 minutes. It'll tell us our leg. Or in this case, we'll just do 10 mile legs, as that's fairly common. And also shows our fixed ETA. We could put an EFC time in, which is our expect further clearance time. It doesn't do anything right now, but we'll just go ahead and put 200. Normally, the airplane, uh, once you get close to the EFC time, it'll have a little message pop up saying you're getting close to the EFC. Um, so everything looks good here. We'll go ahead and execute the hold. And we'll go back to the legs page. And now you can see we're flying direct to Luigi, and then it's going to hold at Luigi for the uh, next sequence. So, and we'll go ahead and just do a little quick time lapse for the entry here. All right, so here we are. We just did the, uh, I guess, the uh, course reversal there, the parallel entry. Uh, still little tweaks to, to be made, and I was also coming in at 300 knots, so that wouldn't help either. Slow back to 210. Uh, still some adjustments, of course, but uh, now we've got the uh, outbound course shown up here. So the FMS is going to, um, it basically does a hold with a, const or a rate of turn and a constant bank angle. So depending upon the winds, it's not exactly going to follow the magenta uh, course here. However, it's going to do its best to follow the uh, inbound and outbound legs here. So you may notice some discontinuities with that, but uh, it should be okay. Um, but you also notice here that once we've uh, basically passed the holding fix, um, on the, uh, especially on the procedure there, you see an option for exit hold here. So this feature, basically it depends where you are inside of the hold, but um, I'm pretty sure when you cross a beam here, when you hit exit hold, it's going to complete the rest of the holding pattern until it crosses the holding fix and then it's going to continue on. So uh, you'll notice if we, uh, I think when you press it before that, it just continues on to the fix, as in it'll just continue around. But um, when you go ahead and click that, you'll see exit armed. Yep, right there, see it just went to HANA. So if we waited until we were just a beam and we were established on the outbound leg, once we hit exit hold, it's going to arm the hold, or arm the exit, and then it will not continue along until it passes, on, uh, passes the holding fix again. So, those, uh, that's pretty much holds in a nutshell. Go ahead and play around with them, and uh, I think you'll enjoy it.